I almost ran for mayor of Washington, D.C. in 2010. And I found that Washington, D.C., the nation's capital, the majority African-American city, had the second highest poverty rate in America. Almost 40% of every African-American citizen in that city was living in poverty. So you look at those statistics and you say, what in the world is going on here? Lack of economic opportunity. So we're where we are today because we have the entrepreneurial spirit has been taken away from us. You talk about economic um, development, um, business opportunities, uh, business growth, small business development, all of those things the African American community still is not seeing the full fruition of. Our education in America has not provided or prepared us to be able to compete with Europeans economically. So we should not be surprised that we're so economically backward because we were never taught how to be economically forward. Racism was an economic issue. It's always been an economic issue. It's not a social issue. It's not a political issue. It's an economic issue. I'm Madam C.J. Walker's great-great-granddaughter. I grew up in the hair care business with both parents working in hair care. Capitalism means learning how to own and control the land, resources, and businesses, and use other people's labor to enrich yourself. It was terrible for the Negro Leagues. Integration is terrible for the Negro Leagues. It's about ownership of assets, and that's where real wealth is created, and that's where real power is created. And it's not social integration, it's not civil rights that determines your opportunities, your equal opportunities, or your competitiveness. It's what you own and control in terms of viral resources. That's what determines what you're gonna get in this world. We are being faced with economic annihilation, which is why if we don't come together and unify as a people, it's only a matter of time before there might not be too many African Americans left in this country. The fight today is not for equal rights, it's for equal economic empowerment. Which end of the stick do y'all want? You want integration, you want segregation? I said, I don't want either end of the stick.